Welcome, welcome back to my YouTube. What is up, fam? I'm so excited that you guys are here. If you're brand new, my name is Coach Bree. Welcome to my page. I'd love to get to know you guys down below in the comments. So drop your name, drop anything fun, exciting about you, um, what you like to do, what you want to learn, what you want to see on my page. I'm so excited that you guys are here. Um, this is actually the second time I've done a video like this. Um, and it's just quick, simple, easy dinners that we tend to go towards. So again, I'm a nutrition coach. I've been in the industry for about 15 years. Um, I've competed in bodybuilding, bikini, CrossFit, Olympic lifting, power lifting. Um, the only thing I really haven't done is like marathons and I'm not sure when I'm gonna get to that, but um, we have two kiddos. You will see my amazing husband here in videos every once in a while, he likes to pop in and give his two cents. Um, we own a gym in Loveland, Colorado, and he does that full time. Um, Brady is almost two, Blair is almost three months. So we have two under two right now. And then we've got two mountain dogs, uh, Luna and Leo. They are full blown human size. Luna weighs 105 pounds. Leo weighs about 120 pounds, except for Leo is fun fact. He's my little snuggler. He likes to just snuggle in bed. He thinks he's like this big when really he is absolutely massive. And actually he knew I was pregnant both times before I did. So he was just like, following me around my shadow. So you'll see Leo in a lot of the videos as well. Um, I post every Monday and Thursday. So again, I would love to hear what type of content you guys want to see on my page. I do lots of family stuff, healthy recipes, um, quick, easy, simple dinner ideas, fitness, workouts. I coach hundreds of men and women inside my Team BGF app. We have follow along workouts. Uh, hundreds of healthy recipes, um, registered dietitian challenges, and so much more. So welcome, welcome. I'm so glad that you are here. Every single like, comment, share, subscription helps me so much and spread my, me uh, my mission of helping as many people as I possibly can. So thanks for being here. Let's jump into it. Right, we are getting ready to have some dinner and a really simple one that we love doing. Well, this is the first time we're trying this one specifically, but Trader Joe's has these like chicken breasts with all kinds of different marinades or like sauces or just different dressings on them and super simple. <laughs> You'll hear Brady and play in the background. So we cooked that up. We actually just threw it in our pressure cooker, um, added some potatoes in with it. But this one was a pesto chicken. Um, so it already comes with like the sauce, the seasonings um, in it, and you just have to like cook it up. So if you have a Trader Joe's by you, uh, check out for some of these chicken breasts. And this is just a super simple, easy dinner. We prepared it this morning, and then it got done um, a few hours later. So you can do it that way. I think the ingredient or the instructions, Brandon honestly made it. Can you say hi to the YouTube fam? What's up, team? Um, Brandon made it, and the the instructions were actually for you stove could grill. top. You could grill or, or stove, stove top. top. But we were like, uh, we have so much to do this weekend, so let's try throwing it in the pressure cooker. So I'm not sure exactly if that's the right way to cook it or the best way to cook it, but we just did it. Yeah. So, I mean, it looks good. Have you tried it yet? Um, it's definitely pesto. So if you like pesto, pesto chicken, you could pair it with pretty much anything. We just did potatoes, but rice or pasta could be really good with like a pesto pasta if you really like that. But super simple, easy dinner. That's packed with protein, obviously, because we love those protein dinners, obviously. Strong, toned, lean physique. Brandon doesn't really like pesto either, so what do you think of it? Bye bye. What do you think? Oh, is that you on it? No, it's not, it's not bad at all. It would be, I think, really good in pasta. There you have it, folks. Try it with pasta. So, night number one, easy dinners. Try it out. Do it. Another night, a new, another super easy meal prep idea or recipe for you and your family. This was actually our Team BGF meal prep of the week. So if you didn't know, a little shameless bug inside of our Team BGF app, 
we have hundreds of high protein recipes and I add at least one of those uh, every single week. Um, this one was a, like a chicken noodle soup inspired, but it's actually chicken and rice soup. Um, however, I did not add as much chicken broth to it, so I made it kind of just more of like, it has the comforty feel of that chicken noodle soup. It's just not actual soup, but you can add more chicken broth and make it a soup. Um, and it's so easy to make, guys. Like literally, you just add your uh, cut up carrots and onions to a little bit of put butter inside a pan. Wow, I can't talk, it's been a long day. Um, let those cook up, let them soften. And then you're going to add in um, about a cup, cup and a half, two cups, however big of a recipe you wanna make uh, to that pan of non-cooked white rice. Uh, anywhere between five cups and eight cups of chicken bone broth. Um, you just cover that, let it cook on low until that rice is completely cooked. Then you just add cooked chicken on top of that. Let it all like, you know, stew together. I added also um, garlic, onion, paprika. You can also add like celery, things like that to make it more chicken noodle soup inspired. But we are just having this for dinner. It's ultimately a leftover um, or a meal prep recipe that Brandon took some to work. Um, and like I said, it's a one pot dish. So this is number two. If you guys have not tried this recipe or if you're already inside of our Team BGF app, go find this one because it is so good. It's gonna be a staple for us like all winter long. It's just like comforty and warm and kind of has all those seasonings and flavors to make it like a chicken noodle soup, but on a healthier level. All right, dinner number three, as you can tell, is steaming hot. And I just realized I put on the same sweatshirt that I wore yesterday's video. I promise it's a new day, I promise. It was just conveniently placed over there. You guys know. Um, we are big Goodles fans. Goodles fans. So tonight's dinner that is super simple, easy, family friendly, that is packed with protein, is we literally just take this family box of Goodles. Um, I found that the protein content is a lot higher as well as the ingredients are better for a mac and cheese. So 16 grams of protein, seven fiber, um, 21 nutrients from plants with Goodles. And they have like different flavors. Um, and then honestly, we add in a just meats container for the chicken, but you can use any type of chicken, uh, chicken breast, chicken thigh, you know, if you already have some cooked or you can cook it up yourself. But uh, we use the just meats chicken and literally it's just chicken mac and cheese. And that's a comfort food for me. And the fact that it's high protein, do you wanna say hi? Brandon made it. So Chef Boyardee over here. <laughs> But this is dinner, so guys, try it out. Keep it simple, keep it easy. Literally, Brady loves this meal, so I always try and take meals that are familiar for us or that we love and make them just a little bit more macro-friendly. So this is a staple, try it out. 